Now, renovations are underway at the National Voice of America Museum of Broadcasting in Westchester. The museum's hosting an event to raise money to pay for those renovations. And here to tell us more about it, the museum's executive director, Jack Dominic. Jack, thanks for coming Hi, in Jack. this morning. Oh, my pleasure. My pleasure. It's uh, we're really excited. Yeah. Uh, you know that. Uh, the museum, the, the Voice of America facility is a really iconic place. I mean, going back to 1944, yeah. uh, through the World War, through the Cold War, uh, and and its impact on the world is is nothing short of amazing. And that's the thing, that's not just an impact here, around no, here, an right. impact on, literally, on the world. Yeah. Correct, yeah. correct. And a lot of people don't realize that, which is not at all uncommon, because, you know, the Voice of America was never meant for you and I. Right. It was, it was meant for for uh, the rest of the world. And then, of course, the building out there was a fortress. You know, you didn't go near it. You know, <laughs> so people were afraid of it. Uh, but we're, we're turning it into a museum of, uh, of uh, uh, about broadcasting, yeah. about the Voice of America. And we're having a, a celebration. Interestingly enough, the 23rd of September yeah. is the seven, 75th anniversary of the day they turned oh, wow. Bethany Station on. Oh, now, get out of here. If, so if it's good people timing. go to the museum after these renovations, right. I mean, we're looking at a little bit of video, but right. what will you be able to experience Well, there? first of all, the Voice of American control room and samples of the programming, mm -hmm. et cetera, et cetera. But I'm delighted. When people come through there, they always uh, say, you know, well, what's W uh, and Crosley and all that? Well, <laughs> the, Crosley built it. Uh, okay. So that's Powell that's Crosley. Powell yeah. Crosley, right? Mm -hmm. So and we realized that there's a great interest in Powell Crosley, uh, you know, a Cincinnati icon mm -hmm. for sure. Mm -hmm. So what we've de decided to do, and we're also opening on the 23rd, a uh, museum, uh, a, a exhibit of all of everything Crosley did. Ah. Crosley did so many different things. He did cars, he did airplanes, he, he did radios. He had a car named after him, didn't he? The Crosley. Yeah, exa exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Uh, of course, the radios. Right. Uh, he, he did a hair grower. <laughs> he did? <laughs> he was the first person to put shelves in a refrigerator. Uh, I wow. mean, yeah, really? I mean, all these, all these crazy, crazy things. So we have a, a, a wonderful exhibit, the most uh, complete exhibit of anything about Crosley in the whole United States. Mm -hmm. And that'll, that will start on the 23rd. The 23rd is a, is a gala celebration. It is a dinner. It is a reception. It is tours of the museum. And yes, it is a fundraiser mm -hmm. because uh, we don't get any money from the feds. We don't get any money from the state, et cetera. Uh, it's really private donations. So that's what the uh, the event's all about. And you've got a very special guest coming out to help you. We certainly do. Nick Clooney's coming out. He's mm -hmm. going to be our uh, MC, And then Carmen DeLeon and the studio oh. big band will be out there. Wonderful. So we have music, uh, wonderful food, et cetera. And anybody interested in coming, we'd be delighted. You could just go to our website. It's so simple. I mean, you don't even have to write it down. VOAMuseum.org. That's yeah. a pretty simple one. We like that. Pretty if simple. If you can't remember that, we have a link at local12.com. It's 150 per person, Saturday, September 23rd. If you want to get involved, just log on to the website. But certainly something worth visiting, even if you can't go to the dinner. For sure. And, Thank you. And the exciting thing is, is mm -hmm. the museum is going to be open beginning in October, every Saturday and every Sunday. So you can, you can come out. Uh, if you can't come for the uh, for the dinner, uh, come out for a weekend, bring the kids. Uh, I think you'll have a great time. Sounds great, Jack. Thank you so much for coming. Thank